more than I needed to know. <laughs> he was in shock. He was totally shocked. He says, Congressman, this was a campaign. This was not the vote. You voted already. <laughs> That's what it was. I love that. What? Oh, the desserts look wonderful. Lynette, do you need any help? I got it covered. No problem. Okay, uh, Scabbo, you're up. Let's hear this genius idea of yours. Okay. Uh... The single greatest obstacle facing Spotless Scrub is a lack of visibility. We need to concentrate ad spending in places where women spend the majority of their time. For example, large chain grocery stores. Picture Spotless Scrub ads on the side of every mother's shopping cart. Interesting. Oh, you know what would be even better? Dry cleaning bags. What? No, really, hear me out. Put a big spotless scrub ad between a woman and her cashmere sweater. I guarantee you'll get her attention. Honey, honey, that's great. I'm just, I'm in the middle of a thing here. Oh. <laughs> she, she's got a point. I would notice that. And those dry cleaning bags hang in our closets forever, and so it is like constant advertising. Exactly. You know, maybe, maybe there's a way that we can work you that in. You know, this is a main kind of a fantastic idea. We go nationwide with this? Why not? Start by targeting the top chain, then branch out from there. Boom, boom, boom. Mass saturation. Oh, and you know what else would be a great idea? Here's the well, thing. Well, Lynette maybe was commanding everyone's Bags, you know, attention. You know what I'm saying? 